Hello and welcome to California Geography. My name is Jeremy Patrick and I'm the backyard geographer. I'm really excited to share the next set of videos with you and really spend the next probably semester learning and teaching with you the stories, the legends, and really the exciting parts of the geography of California. I really wanted to take a moment first to introduce who I am. Again, I said my name is Jeremy Patrick. I've, I've been teaching a while. I've been very fortunate in that I've had the opportunity to teach students all across the state of California, from UCLA to Cal State Northridge, Santa Monica City College, College of Alameda, Pasadena City College, and even College of the Canyons. So I've been all over the place, and the one thing that I look forward to the most when teaching are field trips. So this is going to be a little bit different. You know, I really enjoy teaching this course in person because we get to go on the field trips. We get to taste the flavors of, of the culture of California. We get to view the sights and sounds of the landscapes that are without the state. Unfortunately, we can't do that quite yet. So I'm really utilizing uh, the opportunities that are within YouTube to share my passion, my excitement, and this course with you. So as you'll find throughout this course, there'll be a handful of videos each module. You know, some that are just traditional PowerPoints where I, I explain, you know, things that I enjoy, the passions, the, the research that I have and have been completing on California's history and geography, as well as some out in the field videos, some more intricate looks on specific locations, places, and even historical artifacts that really tell the true story of California. Now, the, what we're seeing on this screen here is just your first module, the welcome to the course, the welcome letter, tips for success on Canvas. Um, I'm utilizing a text from 1911. I'm, I love it. I think it's a fantastic text. I have some other uh, attributes that have been worked in throughout this course, other PDF research articles and such, but I use this book because, one, it's public domain, so it's free for everyone to utilize. But the other reason is that the author had a great perspective on how he observed California. And, you know, especially at a time in 1911 when we still weren't sure what plate tectonics was. And he was very adamant about what he was able to observe and interpret in the landscape when it came from just the regions, the people, the culture, the sounds, the landscapes. And it's going to be a really fun way to view this course is through not just a historic lens, but we're going to be able to take his story and his understanding of California and bring it together with what we know and we can see in our backyards, and it will all come together in a great way. As you'll see, we have weekly discussions. I'm really excited about how these discussions are set up, is that they're set designed by watching a video. We will be utilizing Huell Hauser's California Gold in all of our lectures and all of our modules throughout this course. You might have seen one of his videos when you were growing up on PBS. I've seen just about every video. They're about 28 to 30 minutes long, and what you'll be doing is very specifically within the prompt, I give you a topic that I want you to research in one of his videos and watch his video and really reflect on the, well, what did you learn? You know, what was exciting about it? What, what stories did you learn? Because we'll find that geography, as we progress through this, course is not just landscapes. It's the people. It's the the way it looks, the way it tastes, the way it smells, the way we hear it, the language. I mean, there's so many different attributes, the economics. I mean, you know, the trade, the agriculture. There's so many different elements of what geography can be. And this course really embodies a little bit of everything. And Huell Hauser did a great job researching some of our local entities, some of our local sites and sounds, and county fairs, and farmers, and collectors, and musicians that really make California the golden state. You'll also, as you'll see, you'll have a, a book review, a short novel by one of, you can to choose, of John Steinbeck's books, and you'll write up a report on that, and, and really not just you know writing the report on the story that you read, but relating it to the geography of California. All of the books that have been you know, provided, the ones that you get to choose from, are all based out of California at different times in history. But the location, the time, and the people involved really paint a picture 
into California and what it would have been like to experience the state at that time. You know, we've got a lot of different things to go through this semester. I'm really excited to share everything with you. You know, as you'll see, one of the first things that we'll be working into is just the overview of the state itself, where we'll learn more about just what is California known for. And what we'll learn is that it's known for everything from being the, the one of the hottest places on Earth, one of the lowest elevations, one of the highest points, one of the oldest living trees, the second living old, oldest trees in the world, the tallest trees, the largest trees, so many different things, diversity within culture, so many things that you're going to be able to appreciate throughout this course. I'm excited to share this with you. I'm excited to work with you. Um, and I'm, you know, my, I have an open door policy. Never hesitate to reach out, visit during office hours. I look forward to it. Maybe you're not even in my class and you just came across these videos. Please be sure to reach out to me. And if there's something that I can help with, something I can share with, maybe you're looking for content or some research on something in particular. I mean, aside from just being a California geographer and being a backyard geographer, also having a degree in geology, I'm also really involved in history, specifically looking also at the history of the Walt Disney Company. So maybe there's just something that interests you that you want to know more about. Be sure to let me know. Comment below. Don't forget to like this video. I'll be seeing you through a bunch more context. I'm looking forward to sharing this with you. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll talk soon.